revenue account determination. So, what is the exact purpose of this revenue account determination means? Whenever we have made the sales, automatically what will happen is there was an A, income will be plus price. That income which we are not calling as in a profit. Why? Because profit is a different from the revenue. So which we got the revenue, from that revenue, how we will get the profit? That will be happens by through the financial things. But initially, whenever we are getting the revenue, how we can get that revenue? How we will get that revenue? That was the main point here which we are discussing on today. So, and before that, let us log in. Let us log in here. And then... From here. So, first of all, let us start with the revenue account determination. As which we discussed, how the revenue will become for the sales organization or else for the company from the sales department. From the sales department, how we can make the revenue. For that, which we can use the revenue account determination. So, how could or how we people can have the revenue account determination here in the SAP sales and distribution. That's what we are going to done here. For that purpose, first of all, we have to give that the master data which is relevant for that particular revenue account information. For that, <coughs> from here, SPRO, IMG, Sales and Distribution, Yago, IMG, Sales and Distribution, and then basic functions, and then basic functions. From that basic functions, account assignment and costing. functions, account assignment and posting, from the account assignment and posting, the revenue account determination, under that, check master data relevant for account assignment. So which of the master data are relevant for this? Revenue account. See, by the material wise, we can get the revenue. And as well as customer wise also, we can get the revenue. So here, first of all, let us go for the Materialized Recovery Account Determination. First of all, double click on here. Material Account Assignment. See here, trading goods, services, finished goods, empties, own fees, external expenses, fees, OSS, distributment and others, and all other plan. That means, whenever we are getting the revenue from the sales, automatically the material of that particular sales should be in the account assignment group of which account assignment group. See, when we are creating the material master, let's see that. Let's take the MM02. That means the changing of the customer master. Changing of the customer master. Sorry, material master. And which material master? In the plant of REM team for the material of something I have been wrong with. Something wrong. Okay, 43 grade cement. And that. So, which we have already created this material, and I want to change that material master in the plant of REM team. For the sales organization of RDA MS, for the distribution channel of RDA. If you can observe here in the sales organization 1, or else the sales organization 2, the shipping a account assignment group will be there. That means whenever the material will be, our material 
account assignment groupies either financial goods or the trading goods or the pay fees or virtual goods but that which we have created here in the cell which is already there even in the real time nothing will be there but we need to create here what you want just go to for the new entries <coughs> and give your new account assignment and what is that type of the material that means instead of the using of which is already available of the account assignment groups we can create our own account assignment groups also for the material master for the material master from here for the material master from here and then this is the material and as well as if you can go for the customer let us check it out the customer how the customer account assignment group will be there let us change the customer master in very 0 2 0 1 is for the creation and 0 2 is for the change for the customer of under the sales formation of RBNS for the sales area of Mumbai sales formation of distributors see here it will be shows that domestic revenue foreign revenue and as well as affiliated company code revenue as like that one creation of a customer master in our sales area data in the billing documents see here the account assignment group that means how the account of revenue has to be maintainable how the revenue has to be maintainable for that purpose here it is a domestic even this can be handled or this can be came from here also that means first of all which of the master data has to be maintainable in the sense of the first one will be the customer master data and the second one will be the material master data if these of the two master data these of the two master data have been applicable or has itself has itself applicable then how it should be or else how the revenue has to become that's what we have to say first of all customer and as well as the material customer and as well as the material and the next thing which we have to go for the revenue account determination from here the next thing is in a creation of a database tables so up to here we have maintained the customer of the master data and as well as the material of the master data and the next thing which we have to go for the maintain of a condition tables for those of the things so for that purpose see here these are the keys of the customer account assignment group and come back for the define dependencies of the revenues that means in the next step define dependencies of the revenue account determination under that the revenue account for the revenue account determination already the tables has been already maintained even if you want to see that or if you want to change that also we can do that but initially what i'm doing that i want to create myself that's why I am going to the create of my tables. This is also one type of the condition technique. And what would be the table number? Our wish, we can take any of the table number. So which I am saying that 890 and enter. When I am giving the 890, it asking about of the table name and at that in that 890 or from that 890 which of the fields has to be satisfied for that revenue account determination for making of the revenue account determination which of the tables has to be maintainable which of the tables has to be maintainable that's what i'm going to done here so for that purpose which i need to maintain the value fields of the keywords from the field catalog from the field catalog <coughs> and <coughs> from the field catalog which of the fields has to be applicable 
for best thing of this accounting key, account assignment group, and as well as account assignment category, on the account assignment group, and as well as the sales organization, and including with that, what is the distribution channel? So all these are the things which is required for the table of eight not eight nine zero and then generate. Yes. Okay. Condition table eight nine zero was created. And the next for this eight nine zero, I need to maintain the access sequence. See there, define access sequence for account determination. That means how this has to be worked. That's what called as an right? access sequence. How this condition table will be accessed. For that purpose, first of all, what we have to go for maintain the access sequence for account determination and then press enter under that select new entries so even you can take your own country when you account determination or else we can use the existing one also not a problem at all your wish so the predefined one it is the revenue account determination for request in the KOFI FI or else you can add your own condition also or else CF I'm going for the predefined one I'm taking the KYFI access sequences so these are the ordinary tables which is have and you will go for the new entries what it was say something around 79 and the table name is 819 done and save it and select it and then go for fails excuse me excuse me sorry so here account key, account assignment group, account assignment group for customer sales organization and as well as the distribution channel also has been added in our condition type of the KO FI Instead of that, I want to create my own. Even you can, not a problem at all. So, whenever you want to create your own, just select the new entries and then give your condition type. And under the condition type, you can add your own one. That means, see, I have added for KYF right now. Uh, first of all, I am removing that one. Okay. And then save it. Okay, do not make any of the second entries. Okay. See? I was okay. Now from here, select new entries. A B C D revenue save it select it access as new entries and the number and the condition table and then select it fields the fields and search as like this which we can go for the so this is what we can call as a right? condition type per condition type per so and so this one and now after completion of this access sequence which we have taken the access sequence of the ABCD with the best access sequence I want to maintain the revenue from the for that purpose, see so yeah, define and assign the account information procedure, define account information procedure, 
here also. This is the procedure which we are having. Even if you want, if you want to create a new one, let's take as an A, B, C, D, or else D, E, F, G, revenue, save it, select it, in the control data, select new entries, step number anything 10, and the condition type is A, B, C. Okay, that was not a condemnation. And then save it. Other else no? it was already there. One of the things, which is called the right KOF5100. So KOF5 KOF. Even if you include for the new entries and give the 20 and the ABC, okay, that was not say. So we can use this one, this type of the account determination for the your own account determination procedure. Most of the situation we are not taking the by if we are taking the so by default as a account determination procedure and we are adding that access and condition back. And now go for the, the same account determination procedure and position. For which type of the building you need to apply this revenue account determination? For the SOB predefined building type is F1. See, invoice. For this, it has to be automatically after a couple of these account determination. Either DEFG or phone. Which you want to apply. And then say. And now, till now, we have done the what is the condition type and how it should be and how it would be. But we didn't assign it anywhere. That's why in the last step, which I'm going to here, assign GL account. See, our condition table also is there. So it was an 890. And just go for double clicking on the 890. 890. How this condition has to be satisfied? How this condition has to be satisfied? And then go for new entries. New entries. And here, account, first one, account assignment group, or else the application area. By which application area? By the sales and distribution. By the sales and distribution. If the condition type is account determination and that can be maintained by the chart of accounts of this chart of accounts can be maintained by the <coughs> FI people already that has been assigned even if you can check it out by the OB62 check it out for the company code of RDM1 see present a chart of accounts of IMT that means in the sales of uh, in the sales of the, the condition type so with the chart of accounts of INT and and we are getting the accounting key of ERL mean if this was an a sales revenue since when the admin came by through the account assignment group of the material is initial goods and the account assignment group of the customer is domestic in the account assignment group of the material is domestic initial goods and the account assignment group of the customer is domestic then the sales was done by through the, through the sales organization of through the sales organization of RMS and that sales was done by the distribution channel of by the distribution channel of by 
R A R A R A and it has to be comes into the which GL account means whenever the sales was done it has to be comes into the company code of REM1 but in which general ledger see here there are going to multiple of the ledgers will be there which has been defined or created by the financial scheme that will be comes into the which ledger it will be comes into the which ledger here even if you can check it out where the lecture was other else go for the FS double zero we can check it out for the company code of REM1 I think so in PNL accounts it was an incomes let me check it out all these are the PNL accounts Capital gains. It is not there. Let me check it out here. In the penal accounts, it was not there. Even if you are not getting like this, you can inform to the finance scheme. They will make the income structure. Otherwise, I will create that income structure. Six nine eight two double zero is there. I'm copying that into six nine eight. 201 but it's not having the full status for yet all these things will be the F5 but we are not having the FIT that's why I am creating those of the things also but even if the FIT will be there we can directly give the instructions to the FIT automatically they will create that one see here in the PNL accounts and find that it was a sales revenue. Sales revenue. Sales revenue. Sales revenue. And whenever this was a revenue, Revenue, it will be the G zero twenty nine. And just say it. And this was there. And what I want to say here is, if the sales was done by through the sales and distribution, and the condition type is whatever we have created the condition type, and the chart of accounts is INT by this chart of accounts. And if the accounting key which we have got, the accounting key is in a sales revenue. And if the customer account group is domestic, and the material account group is finished goods, and by the sales organization from this distribution channel, that has to be comes into the GL account of that has to be comes into the GL account of the sales revenue. That means which we have created already the ledger which is the name to it 600201 I think so let us check it out I will check it out through by the FX double zero see which I have already created the ledger 698201 okay Nine eight two zero one. Let us check it out. Six nine eight two zero one. Six nine eight two zero one. That means by the sales and distribution if the account determination was done by through this chart of accounts and the accounting key was in a revenue, it is in a revenue, 
rash to be covered by through this customer of so and so and the middle of so and so that will be comes into the ledger of in this ledger that will be comes into this general ledger and then save so this is what we can call as an a revenue account determination whenever we are making of a sales at sales revenue or the sales value of the particular product has to be comes into that which ledger in the sense of that has to be comes into the ledger of so and so revenue account determination this is what we can call as a revenue account determination and after completion of the revenue account determination today we will go for the another one also another concept another topic also which we can go for today is another condition type which i am going to here for the condition type is let's take the tax determination so whenever we are doing this one how the tax will be applicable even for making of this tax which we can call as an sin but i am not in the sin now whatever the fi people has been done that for their purpose for that i am adding of this tax i am not creating the sin in the next session we will go for the sin that will be next in a long session maybe on tomorrow or day after tomorrow we will go for that one but today we are today i am going to the tax determination how it is so for this tax determination first of all we have to integrate with the financials like this the first step will be the check calculation procedure for that is prvo ing financial accounting financial accounting global settings tax on sales and purchases basic settings then check calculation procedure as it was in here it was this check calculation procedure and as the case in the pricing procedure the fi people has been already created this tax of sequences and as well as the condition type and everything so let us see here first of all the tax of sequence and i'll write this First of all, we shall shall we go for the access sequence. Let us see where the access sequence will be there. And here, the SME predefined tax procedure and the access key which we are using here is an A M W S T. See here, brother, net tax calculation and access S and even the fields. That means this tax calculation. Can be defined by which of the fields is already is there. How it will be activatable and everything. How it will be, which is there already. Even see, select the M W S T and then go for the accesses under the accesses. If you can go for the fields, which of the fields will be there? Those the those of the things will be there. Yeah, and. See, select this and fields. See by the country code wise and as well as the tax code wise it will be changed by the country wise and as well as tax code wise it will be changed. Yes, okay, fine. Come back here and then go for different condition types. I will just define the condition type. Even if you can set here in the middle also the defined condition type, the input tax procedure or tax access sequence is an MWST. Tax sequence is an MWST. But the tax condition type is MWAS. Let us check it out. M W, sorry, position. M W A S is it that output tax? That means whenever 
we are making the purchases in a, you know according to terminology when we are doing the purchases it will be the um, sorry purchases is an applicable of the input tax and when during of a sales it was an output tax here it was an output tax the classification is and the values which we have taken it was an tax it will be calculated by the percentage wise and it was an tax already is there even if it is not there also we can do that but most of the situation this can be done by the financial scheme not by not for us uh, but we need to make it an assignment of our and after making of this one after making of this one go for the procedure so yeah the defined procedure and here there was a name a number of the procedures will be there which is called as a tax procedures so for which tax procedure i want to apply this one see here what i am doing that already the tax procedures will be there i am taking that by the point of the tax procedure of tax gb that's which we call as a sales tax of the great britain so i have taken that tax d or tax gb or anything and then select it in the control data is that mws is there or not yes it was there instead of that if you have created any of the tax procedure we can add the tax procedure or we can add the tax condition type to here and as well as we can make it we can make it just a second Sorry guys. So here is an MWAS. Even if it is not there, we can create it. Already we have seen that. And after completion of that, what we have to do that this procedure has to be assigned for our country. Why? Because we have created the condition type and everything. But that has to be assigned for for our country, not for the customer or anything. Why? Because all the tax procedures or the taxes will be changing by the company but not by the company by company it will be changing by the country by country you just go for the position button and in which country and what would be the procedure you want i want the procedure of this one done and now for my country i am having my tax procedure for my country i can have the my tax procedure and now even if you want to give the tax percentages how it would be so next step go for the tax procedure in the yeah instead of the basic settings calculation tax codes for sales and purchases in the country of india what do you want for the tax code let's take as an a0 see it is an output tax will be there so how much of the output tax you want to apply other else if you want to apply the apply the tax uh, tax percentage of the 0 percent you can say but whenever you are giving the tax procedure of something automatically we need to see a0 this was the 0 percent and this should be the dr this should be the dr this should be the dr This will be also there, and this will be also here. It means we are giving the tax percentage for one condition, and as well as we are making the uh, um, sorry, deactivating of the all the other things. Now the tax has to be applicable for myself in sense of distribution for that. Sales and distribution, basic functions, taxes, defined tax determination rules. 
Under that tax determination rules, select new entries for the country of India in the sequence of 1 and what would be the tax category you want to apply. So I want to apply the tax category of uh, MW. Let us I want to apply the output tax. See, and it will already exist in the same thing. That means already it was there. Let us check it out. For the country of India, and it was in a in the India already the MW is there. That means the tax has been already applicable mode is there. We need not to apply again. But how it would become that's what we need to do. And after the completion of that check so it defines tax relevancy of the master record. See here customer. When creation of a customer yes, tax liable, tax exempt GST only or tax uh, benefits only, which type of the taxes and which type of the categories will be there. Even if we can check the category, MWAS, MWAST, is there what it was, tax exempt and tax liable. Even if we can check with your customer master, the probability 0 to See here, in the billing, tax category, we have to the tax category. Now here it is asking that, what should it be? Tax exempt, tax, tax allowable, or tax one. See here, zero, tax exempt, one, liable for tax. And which one you want to apply for that? I want to make it as an eh? liable for the tax, that means, Tax has to be applicable for that customer. As the case, for the material, for the material. Let's see for the material. Even here also, MWST. Zero is no tax, one is full tax, two is for off tax, three is for, uh, sorry, below tax. So let us check with the material master of ours. MM02 for this material. See so. Where the tax category will be applicable so. for the country of the India for this material. Is the tax is a tax exempt or liable or a tax? Which one? which one you want to apply. So, I want to apply for this as a taxable. That means the tax has to be applicable and then set. So, as method, I have given the tax applicable for the customer taxes and as well as the material taxes also. Customer taxes and as well as the material taxes also. Now, how this content type will be executable? Let's take for the condition type execution which will be comes through by the uh, with the transaction code of BK11 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 and from there onwards in the BK11 for the condition type as MWAST and what do you want? I want to go for, for through the domestic taxes. And what I want to say that if the country is India, if my country is India, and the tax classification and the tax classification for the customer is for the tax classification for the customer use liable for tax and as well as the tax classification for the material ease tax classification for the material ease if it is in a full tax 
and if it is valid from and to which tax code it has to be applicable. So I have already applied the tax code for the tax GB. Which I have printed with a tax sheet and that's that the tax code is the things in this country by which tax classification it is done from today I must stop this here. Test code of the percentages has to be applicable. This is what we can call as a tax determination. So we call it a tax determination. I think so. Everyone is clear for this? Yes. 